How's it going, everyone? This is the Russian Fazbear, and today we're going to be taking a look at an antique white Casablanca Four Season ceiling fan. This one has the longer blades, making it 48 inches, and it is another one that features Slumber Quiet. And I know, this is like the 5 billionth Slumber Quiet Four Seasons on this channel. I'm like the 10 billionth Slumber Quiet fan overall. But I've always really liked these types of fans, so I buy them whenever I see them. Uh, this one in particular came from a Habitat Restore, meaning that when I bought it, I had no reassurance that the Slumber Quiet worked. But I bought it anyways, took it home, hooked it up, and thankfully it still works. So, all good there. Now, something a little bit interesting about this fan is that it came with a hang true, which you can see right here. This is the hang true, and uh, the crossbar is attached. And on top of that, let's take a closer look at this thing. So, as you can see right here, this is the slimmer version of the Casablanca switch housing that was introduced in either 82 or 83. And I believe the sideband motor housing and probably the motor itself as a result is a little bit more narrow. There's your potentiometer for the slumber quiet. Blades are a little bit warped, but I'll, that's an easy fix. I'll just, you know, like lay some textbooks on top of them and they'll be back in shape in no time. Anyways, so with having pointed out all that, here's the tag. Take a look at that. So, according to that, this fan was made January of 1981, A.O. Now, that second character may look like a Q, however, Q was never used, so I don't believe that to be the case. So yeah, Casablanca, Four Seasons, and according to that, this fan was made January of 81, yet it carries all of the characteristics of a fan as if it was made much later. For instance, I don't know for sure if Hang True was a thing in January of 81. Uh, most fans I have from the the first half of 1981 still use bell canopies. And on top of that, this Four Seasons right here, which is from 1982, has the bigger switch cap. And this one over here from 1981 has the both the wider motor and sideband and then the wider switch housing. And this one is from July of 1981, so a whole six months later. So, just a little interesting thing there. Uh, so, not exactly sure what was going on. Perhaps this uh, just has a uh, error on the tag or... Maybe some shenanigans were going on. Don't really know for sure, but whatever. Doesn't really impede the fan, it's just something I kind of noticed. Anyways, now we shall ignite power. And it is mounted Hunter original style, so it is going to be a little wobbly. And there we have the Slumber Quiet set to its lowest speed the famous aesthetic low. Turn it up a little bit. And the blades do droop a little bit on this one because of their uh, warpedness, but again, it's not that bad. Definitely not as bad as one of those 1979 K63 Four Seasons I've seen. Um, and again, once this fan comes down, I will you know, get the blades back into shape, just, you know, put a little weight on them and it'll all be good.
And I do have another Antique White Four Seasons that was IntelliTouch, however, the IntelliTouch was pretty much broken, so I gutted it and converted it to 3-speed. However, I did always want one of these in the either SQ or Solid State variety, and, and I now have one, which is nice. Turn it up some more. And this is the, uh, around this setting, the lowish medium setting is really when the wobble reaches its uh, maximum threshold. Now if I can get, get the potentiometer to, there we go, turn it up a little more. And the wobbling eases out a little bit. And the bearings are rather good on this fan. Definitely uh, some of the more quiet bearings I've seen of most Casablanca fans. And uh, it lends itself to the spin-down time, as the spin-down time with this one is rather long. It does make a very slight and barely audible, um, like, sound, which I believe is either the flywheel or the motor just barely brushing up against something. But again, once this fan comes down after testing, I can always uh, further look into that. Turn it up some more. Then we'll take it up to full speed. This fan goes pretty fast at full speed. As some of my Slumber Quiet fans don't seem to go as fast as this one, but this one definitely flies. And it's kicking a ton of air. And there you go. Thank you guys for watching. This is an antique white Casablanca Four Seasons from maybe 1981, but somewhere in the early 80s at least. So once again, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you real soon.